So eighth grade course is a continuation of sixth and seventh grade course. Though we do allow people to join chorus in eighth grade for the first time if they come and talk to me and let me know that they're interested, especially band and orchestra students may take band and orchestra or orchestra and chorus. We go on a lot of trips, we do a lot of concerts, we sing music from a lot of different cultures and in a lot of different styles. In addition to our performances that we do with all of our grade levels, eighth graders have the opportunity to audition for spotlights, so a lot of solo opportunities, though I do promise to never make you sing by yourself unless that's something that you want to do. We also have the opportunity to audition for state and district events and to represent Webridge in the greater community. Eighth grade course is a high school credit class, so you do get your fine arts credit for high school completed in eighth grade. It also sets you up to be able to go into the high school chorus program should you choose, and you get to go straight into intermediate chorus instead of into beginner's chorus, which also allows you to go into higher level courses earlier in your high school career which not only is more musically enjoyable, but it can be really great for showing a passion in music on college applications if that's something that interests you. Yes. Chorus is a year-long class, so we expect our students to commit to the entire year. Again, if you're in band and orchestra, you are able to do chorus alongside it in eighth grade, so you would take band and chorus or orchestra and chorus. And students who are already in a music ensemble are welcome to just enroll for course. If you aren't in music and you'd like to give it a go, we would love to have you. I just ask that you come and talk to me in advance so that we can make sure it's a great fit for you and that it's something that you'll be successful in. In high school, you're required to have one fine arts credit. So by completing that credit in middle school, you're able to explore other elective possibilities. Of course, we would love to see you continue in music in high school, which if you do so, you are then able to get a fine arts seal on your diploma, and that's through the state of Georgia, and that is a huge accolade and honor. For chorus, we have concerts and performances in the evenings that are mandatory. However, it is not my expectation that you practice on your own time. I try to make all of our our practicing happen during the day. So I feel it is quite manageable. If you're someone who's very involved in sports or musical theater, you absolutely can participate in other extracurriculars and fit chorus in. It's, it's a way to grow musically, but without added stress. For the most part, we do sing as our primary work and your quizzes would be things that I can observe as a group. However, we do have some cool, fun group projects, things like that, as a way of showing your skills and showing what you know. However, most of our work is performance-based. Students are typically students who are outgoing, they're willing to take risks, they are kind to each other, they're looking for a tight-knit group of friends, they're looking for their people, they are willing to show people that they care about our school community and they're willing to represent our school community. They are students who are willing to, to work hard but also see the flowers in life as they go along.